talking about Arctic sports. You know, there are all kinds of cold weather warnings across the country saying don't go outside unless you absolutely have to. So what happens in places like Green Bay, New England? 60,000 people go outside <laughs> together to watch a bunch of guys in tights and short sleeves hit each other. <laughs> so what exactly is going on here? With 30 below wind chill, it's going to warm up slightly about zero degrees, but it's only going to get colder as the game goes on. It's all part of the temperature expected to be around a degree, maybe <laughs> a kickoff when the Packers take on the Giants. The question is, who has the advantage in a game like this? I mean, you have to think the Packers are going to have some kind of advantage. Again, home field advantage. So many of their fans actually welcome this and they're so, so into the team, so crazy about it. they'd be here if it was 50 degrees colder. They'd have no problem with it, but you've got to be kidding. <laughs> Makes me feel like a real sissy. If you leave your dog outside for three hours in this kind of weather, they will lock you up for cruelty to animals. I, I tell you what we've done. I got room temperature water. We just brought it out, and we're going to see how this water is at the end of the show. And our water, uh-oh. Hey, wait, <laughs> I, what happened to our water? In NFL history, the three coldest games tonight, number three. Green, 23 degrees. North Pole, Alaska, 23. In Moscow, it's 31. And here in Green Bay, Wisconsin.